course you click record and you have to start scratching your nose. What's going on guys? This here is Sit Comics here with a channel update for you guys. Um I know it's been sort of a while since I did one and I wasn't going to do another apology video. I was just gonna straight give you videos, which seemed like it worked. Uh, but to the meat and bones of this, um, a bit of personal news before I get to what's going on on the channel here in the near future. Uh, I started a new job. A lot of people keep asking me about it, so I decided I'd just put it up here for the world to know. Uh, I've started working for Uray Sportswear here in Colorado, uh, very close to Denver. I, don't, I think it's Denver. There are so many freaking counties and city lines and where I live, it's hard to know where anything is. But I work for them. Uh, I really do like it there for at least the moment. Um, my only issue with them being that it's really hard for me to stay busy sometimes because it's all automated and I'm used to, when it comes to being in the t-shirt industry, I'm used to everything being manual. So it's a little weird because I'm working at my same pace but I'm running out of stuff to do. But whatever, I'm sure it'll get handled with the company eventually, and as I said, for right now, for the hours, um, the hours actually do allow me to do regular video uploads, so it works for me. For right now, it works for me, and it gets me everything else I need for my personal life. So, for right now, it's a good thing. Uh, up to channel updates, uh, the reason why you guys are actually here uh first thing right away is I announced it over the weekend. I couldn't get it completed over the weekend because there was too much that I had to coordinate. But I'm getting it underway. Um my YouTube channel, if you noticed, is very, very bleh. It has a lot of unupdated playlists. The background's just flat black. It's a very boring channel to go to. Just so boring. So I figured, you know what, it's time for me to uh, update it if I really want to do this YouTube thing, which I do. I really do love doing this YouTube thing. Uh, I really do love doing all these videos for you guys. I really love the responses I get from people sometimes. Uh, I'm going to do my best to pretty up the channel. I'm working with an artist to get me a channel background going. Um, he and He'll get that to me when he can, so I'll know when you guys know uh, when it's up. Uh, as well as I think I might be, you know, doing little things, updating all my playlists. I might change my thumbnail to something that's not a two-year-old picture of me, even though I really miss that beard. You know, as well as I might do custom thumbnails on my videos if I have the patience to make that work. Uh, either way, I just, you know, I think my channel needs to be prettified and sprucified and however you want to call it it needs to it needs to look better it needs to be more entertaining to go to it needs to be something people want to look at so i think that's it's time that i do that uh some video news coming up soon i've uh with the three videos that i've been doing commentaries over recently grand theft auto 4 fallout 3 and uh splatterhouse one thing i've noticed is that over time and this is weird because you would think most people would be in the reverse of this. Over time, it's getting a lot harder for me to be myself in videos where it seems that way. Like, I don't know, I just get very monotonous. from For people who are around me on a constant basis, that ain't who I am. I'm not monotonous <laughs> by any means. In fact, I'm sometimes crazy. But... It's not showing up in my videos. Um, it showed up a little bit in the Fallout 3 I Like Race Cars video. It showed up a bit with the actual race car uh, that I can be a goofy turd. Um, it also is showing up in Splatterhouse, but as far as like Grand Theft Auto 4 goes, it's it shows like one for two minutes every five videos, and like the last one that went up had a two-second clip of it for a guy who hit me and I went after him for car insurance and that's it and it's not good um it's not something I would watch I wouldn't watch my own stuff and I wouldn't expect other people to watch my stuff uh, if I don't consider it good myself so I'm going to work on that for you guys I'm going to do the best I can to bring energy into the video, bring me into the video, just me and my loco self, 
instead of this very objectified guy, um, to be more of who I actually am in the real world, instead of who I am in the virtual world. I actually pointed to my Xbox that you guys can't see. Strange. Um, as far as, uh, new series coming to the channel, I do have a couple, uh, in the works. There is, uh, the one series I want to do, I'll start it off on Halo 4, but I think I'll open it up to, uh, every FPS available, um, is that I'm planning on doing a series called, God, my itch, sorry, I'm planning on doing a series called something along the lines of The Rookie Mistakes, uh, what that means is there's a lot of people out of there, a lot of people out there, who, uh, want to be better gamers, but they have Call of Duty Syndrome, and what I mean by that is that when something goes wrong with the game, it's lag, it's a weapon not performing, it's the other guy being a... Well, I won't say that word in a vlog, but I'll probably use it once or twice in a video, and I will apologize for that. But just, it's not on the player itself, on the player himself. Anybody who's played Call of Duty for a long period of time either knows this feeling or know somebody who has this feeling. So, what my idea is, is that uh, I will take, and I'll start with my own videos, and I'll probably do my own videos for a long time, but I will open it up to everybody out there who has the ability to record or theater mode in Halo or something with a game that I have. Um, or, like I said, just give me a straight recording. And what I'll do is I'll go through, and respectfully, I'll pull out rookie mistakes that constantly get people killed and like I said I'll do it on my own videos as well because I do make those same mistakes but when I go back and look through those videos I can notice those mistakes I'm pretty good at thinking tactically when I'm not under pressure um, I'm gonna go back I go back through I find those mistakes and then I implement that into my next video or my next game session and suddenly I'm getting Kilimanjaro's on Halo 4 because of one checked corner or not feeding a camper or something like that you know just stuff that rookies pull off or even even professional gamers veteran gamers will pull off sometimes uh, just because of the attitude that video games can make you have sometimes of just bullheaded I am taking this lane and it don't always work out that way so I want to do that um I think I've already know a couple people who will be stars on that show week to week. But yeah, that's where I want to go with that. Um, I'm also thinking about, because it seems like my most popular videos are Minecraft creations. And uh, whenever I do a vlog like this one. Uh, so I have those in the works. Um, I'm going to be uploading Gumball Machine 2.0 for... Those of you who haven't seen 1.0, it's already got 750 views on my channel, so I think that's something I should be pursuing. Who would have known? But uh, I'm going to be doing that. I got a couple other things that I've built. I just haven't actually, like, taken the time to make a video for them because my computer is a POS, and it's really hard to. Though I might, um... I might just use my Xbox, and I just now came up with that idea. I might use my Xbox for it, and then I could do it with no lag. Why didn't I think of this before? Because you think well under duress. No, because you think well under this. I'm getting off topic. Um, yeah, I'm going to bring you guys that. Um, I'm going to think about if it seems like there's a, a true desire out there for it. And if there is, you know, please doobly do. Uh, I'm probably, I might start doing weekly or bi-weekly vlogs and see where that takes me. I'm just talk about the random stuff in my life of which there's lots and lots of random stuff in my life uh, that some people just appear to want to hear. Um, some other things, I've uh, the past couple of weeks been helping out a pair of friends of mine. Uh, I won't drop their names just yet because they're not set up just yet. But I've been helping them to set up their YouTube channels for video game commentaries, and uh, both of them will probably be featured so many times throughout my channel. I, I mean, these guys are real close friends of mine, and they're real good gamers. Ish. <laughs> so I think I'll, uh, 
you know, when the time comes, when they're all ready, I think we might even do a big collective video just to announce both of them and uh, split our subs and split our followers. Um, but, you know, whatever. That's where we're... I'm, I'm going to go with that, and I can actually see those video games being very... Or those videos, those video games. Those videos being very entertaining because we... Uh, in each other's presence, we get testy, we get obnoxious, we get... Everything that, you know, you want in a fun video, we make ourselves have fun, and I think it'd be a great idea for my channel to have these guys, you know, uh, be a collab or not a collaborative, but for, uh, like the featuring channels, and other, uh, featuring episodes on the other people's channels, you know, uh, everybody, that everybody's doing nowadays. So I think I could do that, you know, do that, and I think that would actually be very beneficial. Um, yes, yeah, so there's that, uh, as well as Bros Night. Um, due to my new work schedule, and with a whole bunch of just hell that's been going on, uh, Bros Night has been on hi hiatus for a long time. Um, I haven't been able to do story time, we haven't been able to do ping pong, we damn sure haven't been able to cook. So it's just, but... We're trying to bring it back. Um, I'm going to be putting in an effort on my end. My work schedule makes it very difficult only having two days a week, and i got to do my channel. i got to help on friends' channel. I gotta, you know, I've got social things that I need to go to for my own sanity. Um, so I'll do what I can on that. I'm going to try and see if I can't bring story times or... You know, me and the guys will work it out. We'll try and do the best that we can. Uh, I might have to turn off... Ah, uh, well, whatever. That's for us to discuss later. So that's where I'm at on uh, my updates. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any feedback for me, please, it is very much appreciated. Um, leave it in the comment section or on my Facebook. Uh... Just, you know, anything that you can say to help, anything that you can suggest, anything you can give me feedback on, I appreciate all of it. Even though sometimes it is a bit strange and hard to know whether or not I've been trolled. Because there are trolls that are that good out there. But anyway, that's where I'm at. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, leave comments, feedback, all that other yada yada nonsense. Uh, this has been Sit Comics, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.